Very tense scene unfolding in Florida. A hostage standoff at a Bank of America. The suspect claiming to have a bomb and holding a knife to a woman's neck. A sniper then opening fire with the hostages right there. Victor Akendo from Florida tonight. Tonight, the terrifying moment. The SWAT team coming face to face with a bank robber who took two hostages. Listen, just come out here. Let me see your hands and we'll work with you. We'll work with you. Tense negotiations. You can hear the suspect raising his voice. Deputies urging him to surrender. I know you're going through a lot, but this isn't going to make what you're going through any easier. Authorities racing to the scene of this Bank of America branch in Fort Myers, escorting people out of the building, deploying a robotic dog. Shortly after 11 a.m., we received a call of a bank robbery in progress with multiple hostages. The sheriff identifying the suspect as 36-year-old Sterling Alavache, saying he claimed to be carrying a bomb and armed with a knife. He started to put one of the hostages in like a, a headlock, and he had the knife to her throat. Suddenly, a sniper opening fire, shooting the suspect dead, freeing the hostages. The sheriff said the sniper feared for the hostage's life, and that's when they opened fire. Both hostages were unharmed. David? Well, that is good news. Victor Akendo tonight. Victor, thank you. Hi, everyone. George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.